what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Double A Nine Skills. Welcome back to the Rotor for Champions RTG Edition. Welcome back to number two in the world reward edition, bros. Again, as as amazing as it as it is, as happy as I am, as grateful as I am, as thankful as I am, we get number two. But again, so close to number one, and I feel like that just sums up our year on FIFA 18 this year, bro. So quickly, I'm gonna pop some screenshots on your screen real quick. First of all, I'm gonna show you my last set. So on my last set, we didn't even suffer one goal. We were outstanding. We scored a lot. We didn't suffer. We got our corners. We got everything we needed. And this sprung us all the way into the top two. Now I'm going to put on your screen how close we were to staying number one. Now I know in the screenshots it says 13 at the top, but that's only because it hadn't refreshed. We are number two. It's, it's definitely, oh man, like I said, it's amazing to get number two. I didn't even, you know, getting number two is already incredible. It's just like, oh man, like to kind of sum it up, right? First foot online foot champs, we, we come up short by like a game or two to get top 100. The next one, uh, we get like elite two. The next one, we get top 100 and then we get elite two. And this week, bros, again, we were going so good for top 100. And I don't know if I'm going to show you all the gameplay yet or not, but I'll pop this up on your screen right now. There's 10 games left and the best I could do is elite one. I'm just like this. Just it, it's it's I, I don't know what's going on. Usually like last year at this point, we were already really close to we lead one and, and, and battling for top 100 but again there's no point of living in the past i'm not living in the past we got top 100 once already this year so i know that we can do it we just got to figure out what our mistakes are so right now i'm kind of playing around with my team and i know trust me bros i'm as frustrated as you guys are with changing players i don't want to change players no more jj a coach a stan Vieira staying there's a gap right here and the gap you're looking at is Vidal. Vidal has left. And the reason for Vidal leaving is simply, strictly, that because I have a high medium in Pugba, a medium de high defensive, and then Vidal was a high high. I had one guy that was strictly, you know, always down to defend, and that's it. Last year, when I was doing all my top 100 finishes, I used two defensive mids. And that's why I'm going to bring Bakioko back into the lineup, I believe, guys. This is what I'm thinking, at least. And I know this is going to leave us on bad chemistry, but after rewards, number two in the world, we have 100K right now. I'm hoping we make like at least 100k or something like that and we can snatch up somebody like Vandesar. Do I want to go away from De Gea? You guys know I don't. I'm not selling him. I will not sell De Gea. De Gea is staying. Uh, but somebody like Vandesar, if we could afford him or Smichael, we throw him in. Everybody's on full cam. And now I got more of a defensive push, right? I got Pugba who can score goals. JJ can score goals. Gabriel Asus, Anthony Martial. We bought Mbappe. He's on the bench. Um, so we have guys to score goals, right? We didn't have enough guys to defend. Last year, I always had Conte and Vieira with me, or Conte. And uh, who else did I use a lot, man? I always had two defensive mids. Always, always, always. I always had two defensive mids. And uh, this year, I didn't do that. I kind of went for more of an attacking, uh, uh, attacking. And what I'm doing is getting hit on the counter and losing games. So I want to go back to a more defensive midfield. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Pogba was close to leaving, but Pogba's too good of a player. So let me know in the comments down below if you guys think I'm making a mistake. Man, I just feel like, yo, you know what? Something's wrong, bros. When we got top 100, we had Conte and Bakioko two defensive players this weekend i had blanc at first with pogba and then Vieira with pogba and i and, and i keep going and, and, and vidal was there the whole time and i keep thinking they're the issue and it's not i think i just need more defensive players but either way you guys are here for number two in the world that's what we're gonna do we're so close to getting number one we came up short so close to top 100 coming up short it's just been the way the weekend leagues have been going but it's all right man we'll get it together y'all are gonna be there for me that's, that's 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 what this series is about doing it with you guys number two in the world squad battles hopefully one day we can see a number one right there i'll keep battling away man we were so close i made one mistake throughout the week bros while only scored four goals and it got me like 2,400 points instead of 2,800 points and that's where the gap was and that's why that guy got first and I didn't so this is what we get man we get two. Oh wow look at that kit bros that's all right the bonfire the bonfire night kit I like it ultimate pack and then a rare player pack and 87,000 coins so as you can see we're back up to 240 so at this point already we can afford the big boy Schmeichel already we can afford Schmeichel so we're in a good place we could pick up Schmeichel if we need be um we still have our packs to open up so this should be interesting today we have a Chelsea team okay so at Chelsea what's it looking like for Chelsea man um okay Benzema the boy Ronaldinho boy all on the bench great keeper on the bench Bench, Ronaldo and yet wow and he has the great team great great team Yaya Torre gets the start Yaya Torre is somebody that should give a look this year maybe maybe he has good uh, good work rates for our midfield but anyways bros let's open up these packs we also have our um you know our pre-order packs in the comments down below let me know man do you guys think i'm making a mistake i don't want to keep switching teams i swear what i'm trying to do is find a balance trying to find a team that i can consistently beast with and the team that i can consistently beast with was gabriel asus sanaldo bakioko Conte. it's like the 
the lower end players besides Conte, it's crazy, man. It's unbelievable that I could perform with them, but I can't perform uh, with the big players. So here we go, man. We'll open up the jumbo packs and then we'll open up the rare player packs and the ultimate pack. I believe this this right here is all from the Ronaldo pre-order edition. So let's jump into it. We'll talk more about my team in just a minute. And and oh, we get boards. We get boards from the icon from from the from the uh, from the oh, stop it. Oh, stop it. From the pre-order edition, I thought we got De Gea, bros. Remember last week, out of our ultimate pack, we got Gareth Bale. Bros, I swear, I thought I, if I was, I was about to if I get De Gea right here, we about to go nuts. Um, no De Gea, unfortunately. Uh, but that's okay, man. No big boy De Gea. Uh, hopefully, one of these packs has something good for us. A hawk. We use a lot. Two hawks. We use a lot of that. You guys know that. Left mid to left wing. These things probably sell, right? Because a lot of people go to left forwards for the 4 2 3 one. Uh, not really. They don't really sell. So we'll just keep that around because we use that a lot. And uh, the players will keep as well for squat for uh, SBC. So as I was saying, I'll talk more about my team, man. I promise, guys. Let me open up this loan real quick. I promise you guys, man, we're going to get to the point where I, I just have a team and we good. Um, I know it's fun, like, seeing players and constantly changing and reviewing. But I also want to be getting top 100 for you guys. And right now, your boy's not pulling that off. So I got to get it right, get it tight, get it nice. Um, okay, my man, rap. I, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Don't 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 get mad at me, but I ain't never heard a rap. I'm gonna be honest with you. Never even heard of the boy. But hey, welcome to the squad, man. Lone player that we could use if we want. Jumbo again. This is the last one from pre-ordering the icon edition. Let's see what's popping out this bad boy. No borders this time. It's all right. We already got borders. Elabas, Anthony Martial, or Gabriel Jesus. Okay, that's not in the cards. Damn, 75 rated. Oh, let's get the bad packs out the way. Keep that away from our rewards, please. Keep that away from our rewards. Bat, oh, even a Porto player, Reyes. We bought him in the Newcastle Carrimo. If you don't know, I do Newcastle Carrimo on my second channel. Link down below. Um, oh, very nice. I like this kit a lot, you know. I'm going to lob that on, guys. I'm rocking that. I like that. Juventus kit, that thing's banging. All right, man. I'll probably never get a kit with the bonfire kit, but I'll never get a game on me with the bonfire kit. All right. Here we go, man. We might snatch. Let's see what we make. We might snatch up a Smichael. I don't know. This is our number two in the world rewards. Again, we got Gareth Bale last week. Let's see if this week is a something. Now, we've gotten number two in the world three times in a row. First week, we got nothing. Second week, we got Gareth Bale. Let's see what's popping here. We get borders off the jump. Okay. An inform off the jump. English. Left wing back. It's the boy Young Garino. It's the boy Young Arino, 81 rated Young. Now, does the inform pop first? Could there still be a high rated card behind this card? That could be pretty sick if they lobbed us something else. But we get Young, and I think Young goes for about 50K, maybe 40K, something around there. Big boy Young, a lot, a lot of people are rocking out with that card. Let's see what's popping inside the pack. Is there anything else besides Juan Mata, the boy Nani? Yo, not bad, not bad. This isn't even, this is even our ultimate pack yet, neither. This is not a bad pack right here. Man, we just, we make good money out these. This is why I play squad battles, man. 25K. This is why I play squad battles, man. We make, we make really, really, really good money out of these. I'm going to put this up for 40, but I don't, you know what? I'll just leave it. I'll just, uh, nah, let's put it for 40. Let's lob this up for 40 and see what's popping. Juan Mata, should I sell him? I know 83 rated cards are kind of selling right now because of SPCs, aren't they? Um, you know what? We'll just lob them up. We'll do what we do with all cards. Just lob all these bad boys up and see what's popping. I'm going to get rid of all the 83s because they actually sell right now. Um, and then we'll keep the rest for SBCs. We got two more packs to open up, bros. Wish me luck in the comments down below, man. I hope you guys are getting lucky out of yours, man. You guys are always tweeting me pictures. You got you guys be getting bomb stuff, man. All right, one more rare player and then the ultimate pack. Let's get into it. Yo, give us borders, man. Borders for all three. That could be sick Reno, EA. Oh, borders again? Let's go. Let's go. Another borders. What are we seeing here? Turkish center back? Top rack? Questionable. 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 Hey, before we jump into the last pack, can we get 15,000 likes for number two in the world once again? Can y'all do that for your boy, man? Smash that big old thumbs up. Three times in a row, number two in the world in squad battles. Um, I'm going to lob up to 83, right? Hey, yo, lob me. Lob me an Anthony Martial. Lob me a Gabriel Jesus if I can make some money. Of course not. This is it, man. Can we hit 15,000 likes? If you haven't subscribed yet, already do so. Turn your bell on. It's lit on this side. We get number two in the world every every weekend. Not number one because your boy can't do it. But it's all right. Here we go. Most unique top rated player. Single play. Blah, blah, blah. We got Gareth Bale last week. Come on, man. Yo, EA. Come on. Come on, EA. I believe in you, bros. Lob me something. I hit the button. It's in there. It's in there. It's in there like swimwear. Come on, man. Number two in the world. Lob us something, EA. Please, man. Please lob us something. What's it going to be? 
Okay, it's Spanish. Goalkeeper. No! They did it to me twice. They did it to me twice. Bros, they did it to us twice. Number two in the world this week. Not really going to pay out as much as I thought it would. Well, I actually didn't think it would pay out because the first time we got number two in the world, it didn't really pay out. Then we got Gareth Bale, and this time, once again, no payout, I don't think, bros. Unless there's some, like, low-rated cards in here that go for a lot. Whoo, it could have been. It just, it could have been De Gea, huh? It could have been De Gea. I'm not going to lob those up. We'll keep them. Hey, you duplicates? Anybody, anybody, anybody? Duplicates. Ah, nobody worth anything. All right, bro. So that one was kind of trash this week, bro. So all we could do is keep battling away. Hopefully next week uh, we could pull off something because this week not so much very good. But uh, we still got some money in the bank. So while I have you guys here with me, I've made the decision to make that move to a legend keeper. Now, Van der Sar um, is 300K, which is a bit out of our price range, obviously. Um, we're very close. This is all the stuff that's been selling lately. I sold all the consumables on my account. Uh, we pretty much lobbed up everything we could. Vidal went for 150. I actually messed up on him because I put a buyout of 150. I probably should have put more because I had a shadow on him. Probably could have made a, a little bit more change on him. But either way, the boy Young is going to go for something. Uh, Mata is going to go for something. But it's not going to be enough, I don't think, to get us to Vandasar. So I think we're going to have to go with Smeichel. Um, not really. I want because I... Otherwise, what's his name's not on full cam, bros. And I have to buy somebody to finish off the weekend league. And, and not only just finish off the weekend league, try to get this elite finish, man. Um, so 340 is where we're at. We're not gonna make 100K, unfortunately. So we're gonna have to look at someone like, let's do Icon. Yeah. Let's lob Icon real quick while I got y'all here with me. And again, man, this decision, I don't know. A lot of the decisions I'm making this in this in this Road to Glory, bros, I don't know if it's the right one. I just try to, you know what I mean? I try to eyeball it. Did I pass it? Didn't I? I try to eyeball it and go, oh, this will work for me. This will work for me. That won't work. And I kind of just go off the jump. And honestly, I didn't practice with the team enough to know. But I know it's not Pugba because Pugba's a good player. But I think Vidal and Pugba together, it's too much attacking and not enough defending. Um, so what do we got under? Well, we don't have 280. We'll have 280 once Young sells. So this, man, look at that Young Smeichel Van der Sar right there. So Smeichel is going, he's 6'4". Smeichel's a big boy, 6'4", 6'6". Um, when I look at both these cards, so we should have, we, we honestly should have, once Young sells, we should have some money. So I can wait an hour to pick up the player. Um, but this is a big decision now, man, because Smeichel's going for... We can legit buy Smeichel right now and be broke. Um, and then when Young sells, I'll be able to buy fitness cards. Or I could just wait for Young to sell, even if we discard him and we can get Vandasar. Let's look at the difference. Positioning, Vandasar is better. Reflexes, Vandasar, Vandasar is one less. Diving, better for Vandasar. Handing's better for Vandasar. Kicking, better for Vandasar. So Vandasar... 87 rated looks like a better keeper than 86 rated Smeichel. Would y'all say that? Besides reflex, Smeichel looks like where, I mean, Vandasar looks like he might be the guy, man. So I think I'm going to go with Vandasar, especially for the fact that he's 6'6". That really, really gets me. So for what I'm going to do is wait for Young to sell, bros. Hopefully get Vandasar tonight. Um, as long as, how much was Vandasar selling for, man? Let me just make sure I can afford him, actually, because... I don't want to say I'm going to get him and then like because I'm, I'm 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 going based off the fact that Young will go for at least 20k. That's what we saw, right? Oh, wrong Vanessar. We saw that he'll go for 20k. So if he goes for 20k, where's Vanessar? 87 rated. If he goes for 20k, we'll have like 150, 160. We'll be very close. Plus one Mata will be extremely close and we can get him for 260. There's one here for 260. Really, if I go discard stuff, we could buy him for 260. Um, if I discard stuff from the club. So Van der Sar will make an appearance, I think. And that's the way the team's going to line up. Now, I wish Bakioko was Conte, but we sold Conte. So I'm going to rock out with Bakioko. Everybody will be on full cam, as you see. We just need the keeper here. So I wish I could get big boy uh, Van der Sar. Obviously, we can't, unfortunately. But we'll get his 87 rated here. And the reason I have to do it, bro, is because I wish I could play De Gea. But look at my boy Boateng. He's on seven. We can't we can't rock out with Boateng on seven. So De Gea is going to be benched for the rest of this weekend league. I'll probably lob. Actually, I'll probably bring Sun. Um, and I could, I could sell Mbappe, but I'm not going to. Because Young, Young will give us enough 
to to get a keeper man so i'm gonna try to bang out the rest of this weekend league let me know if you actually i will show you guys all the games i'll show you all the games right now man that's how it stands i have 10 games remaining there's five hours left as you when you guys are watching this and your boy is gonna try and attempt and pull off some greatness and and get 34 wins as long as we get into elite it's good again we got number two offline get into elite and then fix what we have to fix and let's make a run for top 100 next weekend bro and and make a run for top 100 monthly because remember we came three games short of top 100 monthly or something like that last month very very close so with all that being said bros i'm sorry that i'm not performing as well as i want to be in the foot champs but it's a learning process and i will eventually get it hopefully we've gotten top 100 we just got to find a way to get back into top 100 again this year um a lot of stuff to sell hopefully young sells and we can pick up vanisar otherwise i will go with smichael and end off, end off the games i hope you guys enjoyed this reward episode if you did please smash a big old thumbs up sorry there's not more in this episode i probably should lob some gameplay in this bad boy for y'all as well but thank y'all so much for watching man i truly do appreciate y'all hanging out today and watching this video we're very close to picking up michael i don't know if i'm making the right decision with this team but we also can do this which is pretty chill with vanisar back here everybody's on full cam i just like it man we have two players that can win the ball back one guy that could take the ball forward with the coach it just makes sense why have why have in my head i'm thinking to myself why have vidal i know vidal can defend and attack but he's a high high so why have like i just want two guys that are really really about defending and not attacking and then look at this i have one two three four guys to attack you don't need more than four guys so um with that being said man i hope you guys enjoyed this episode i'm gonna do my best to try to end this weekend league right and hopefully the decision i made is the right decision uh to get us some big boy wins man so with that being said thank you all so much for watching big old thumbs up i will not sell that to hey i like him too much make sure to subscribe i love you guys and i'll see you back here tomorrow to see how we finish in the weekend league that's my number two in the world rewards booyah Yo, what's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Double A Nine Skills. Welcome back to the Road for Champions RTG Edition. Booyah Nation, welcome back to what's going to be one of my favorite episodes of this series because today we are going to end up buying what could be one of the best, if not the best, midfielder in the game, the best icon for the midfield. Each is it going to be a ridiculous, man. I cannot wait to show you who we're picking up. But first, Shevchenko and Blanc is starting off the day, and I want you to remember this team, this team right here, because in just four games, we are going to replay him. And the reason I tell you to watch, just watch carefully, Carefully to the score score line, score uh, the score line. I can't even speak in this game and the score line in the next game. And his Harry Kane hits a long shot like that just three minutes in. I'm on the back foot. We got to find a way to get back into. It. Before we go any further, Booyah Nation, I got to stop and say this really quickly. When I made yesterday's video, man. I was in a place that I was just kind of really, really down and depressed because I really felt that a lot of people were just like actually believing what had happened was true and that I actually like would jeopardize the series. Um, and 